and at some point, I um, no, ten years later, I realized that this is not uh, really um, what I want to do for the rest of my life. You sounded like a like a, a genuine person who um, who wants to help people. What stuck in mind um, were conversations, mm -hmm. um, and I think that's uh, that's probably the best. What made the most difference? Mm -hmm. um, the kind of talking through things, the change of of, of mindset is is probably the best, uh, most lasting, most significant outcome. In the end, you know, I, at some point, and I hope that's with all your clients, at some point, uh, you know, light switches on. How you change my mindset is, is that uh, it, it has started appearing as a real possibility. Mm -hmm. A possibility that I would have to explore. It's not, not like, not, 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 again, like turning a switch. There were steps towards it, but I could lay out those steps and then pursued them one by one. My biggest, biggest lesson probably from the, the very highest level is that the, um, the best changes in life are um, those that you actually pursue yourself, not necessarily what falls in your lap. Faith, uh, trust that I could actually embark on something new and pursue a career change like that. Um, kind of eroded and uh, went away. And you helped me rekindle that. Rekindle the trust that I can do that. I still, you know, seven years later, um, feel quite excited. It, it's actually, you know, every weekend feels like I'm, I'm on a tropical holiday. Really. Some things like almost magically materialize themselves. <laughs>